Hey everybody, we're here. New episode, RLG Cast, October, Spookoween, Halloween. October. I'm here with JD. I'm here with Putty Man. Their stuff will be in the bio. Today we're talking our favorite Halloween specials. So we kind of went no rules on this. Um, it could be uh, a, a specific actual special. It could be a specific episode from a show that's based for Halloween. Or it could be just the encompassing of all the Halloween episodes of a show. So we're going to jump into this, and JD is going to go first, and then me, and then Puddy. Okay. Then, in that case, my number five is Caps, the only Caps on the list, and they're fairly recent ones. It's the Netflix special Escape the Undertaker and the Muppets Haunted Mansion. Wait, I, I, I like oh, Muppets Haunted Mansion. I've not it seen was it yet, really good. Too, yeah. That's but actually, that... you'll like that, Puddy. That's a good yeah. one. Um, okay, so I have... Mine are basically encompassing shows. That's what I went for. Like, so yep. my number five is Parks and Rec and The Office Halloween episodes. Okay, so mine is kind of a mixture of specials and sh- episodes as well. So it's gonna be a little bit hot. hot. It, was, it was crazy. Anyway, my number five. It's a classic. That's why it's on my list. It's The Great Pumpkin, Charlie Brown. And I know it's not horror. That's a good choice. Poet. No, That's no, this is choice. Halloween specials. This is Halloween specials. Mm-hmm. Uh, my number four, it's uh, the Garfield Halloween special. I love it. I'm, I'm, I'm I, you know what? I am upset it. because you told me that earlier and I forgot about it and didn't put it on my list. That's when like Garfield gets lost and he's trying to get back his find his way back home and he finds his mother. It's a really touching story, yeah. I uh, gotta agree. I mean, the... oh, I'll say it later. Uh, my is it me already? Yeah. My number four is Bob's Burgers. They got some great Halloween episodes. Yes, they do. I've never seen it, but I need to watch it. I watch Another show, show that you'll like get, you'll watch the first well, season I've and you'll watched, never stop. I've watched episodes. I even watched the Archer episode, but for some reason, she's not catching me on. I guess I got to So just don't game. watch it then. Just yeah. don't. I'm just saying. Mm. Oh. All right, my turn. Yes, sir. Right, so this is in the uh, great realm of Great Pumpkin Charlie Brown, but I feel like it's the more my version, and that is the David S. Pumpkins Halloween special. <laughs> That's literally a skit. No, it's a show. There's actually they do it year round now. It's on NBC. That it's actually a actual no. show during the day. Yeah, it's Seth animated. Seth freaking show Rollins with with Tom Hanks voicing the character. And is Seth Rollins in it? Huh? Seth Rollins is in it. You had to no. watch. You had to watch the last pay per view. Oh, okay. Oh, when okay. he dressed like David S. Pumpkins. Yes, pumpkins. <laughs> uh, okay, so moving on to JD number three. My number three is more of a film Halloween special, and that's Mr. Boogity. We're allowing this. Because um, <clears throat> we're allowing this. Because uh, it's Mr. Boogity. My number three is Community. Uh, some of the best Halloween episodes ever in a sitcom. Okay. My number three is um, what this might be doing to me right now, and that is Pink Eye, the South Park episode. <laughs> <laughs> the zombie one. episode but they have pink eye <laughs> um my number two is an encompassing of all the halloween specials and that's the simpsons treehouse of horror the first few were fantastic the last few have been a little lackluster so it can't be number one all right my number two that's what we're on right two mm-hmm. <laughs> halloween heist brooklyn nine nine that, like, that that's God, and there's so... a Halloween episode. There's a Halloween episode every season. Okay, well, so... actually, one is Cinco de Mayo, but it still counts. Wait, so here that you actually talked said the one thing I was having trouble with because I wanted to like cap that with this, but then I was picking episodes too because I didn't know if you wanted so to cap that with this. Well, it was Brooklyn Nine Nine with community but i picked community episodes epi- etymology i can never pronounce that and horror fiction and seven i mean either way both of those shows i feel like are the only like live action shows that know how to pull off halloween honestly in my opinion community and brooklyn 99 i don't know wh- how, how they're so good at it but it's so enjoyable every time so i agree with you on that one but i didn't put it i put it in honor mentions and i put community so eh, i couldn't i couldn't figure it out and everything so i just kind of played along Okay. Um, my number one. Uh, you met. It's been mentioned already. It's the Great Pumpkin, Charlie Brown. It's a classic. I grew up with that. I watch it every year. I cannot miss it. Agreed. 
Uh, you could throw the chipmunks one out there too. Yes, uh, the chipmunks <laughs> one is really good too. Um, but my number one is Treehouse of Horrors from The Simpsons. Um, I think the they're, they're, like when we say the first few are good, there's like fifteen. Okay, the first twenty. Yeah, well, you know what I mean. Well, it's like, and it's yes, buddy. Well, I was gonna say here's the thing. Yeah, we haven't. I haven't, I haven't seen the new one, but I don't watch The Simpsons anymore. Three House of Horrors, even though I know the last one was bad, I watch every single one of them because I feel like they're more fun than the show now. Like, I, I feel always like watch Three House of Horrors. Yeah. I watch every single one except for the new was well, the newest one out because they always come out the uh, always like after Halloween, which was always it's really usually good. the season premiere. It's in usually in the first couple of episodes for yeah. sure. Yeah. Are they out of the season? I don't know. I didn't check yet. No. I haven't checked this. I've got to see it. But anyway, so the reason I'm jumping in is because uh, John, uh, I agree. My number one is Simpsons Tree House of Horrors. So, <laughs> I mean, but it's for me, it's because I feel they uh, the Charlie Brown thing. It's on my list. It's great, but uh, uh, it's just it's it was more of a kids thing, and and I feel like Tree House of Horrors kind of took yeah, it to kind of. But yeah, I mean, you see what I'm saying? Where I kind of Charlie grew, Brown is iconic. To, yeah, it no, is. I agree. That's why it's on my list. He, it's like those, response. like they all go back to back too. It starts the Charlie Brown trilogy. It starts with the Halloween uh, Great Pumpkin, then it's the Charlie Brown Thanksgiving, and then the Charlie Brown Christmas. Like mm-hmm. it's, it starts that trilogy. It's true, uh, but Treehouse of Horrors is just like an ongoing series. So for yeah. me, it's number one. They do the Treehouse of Horror does great parodies, like mm-hmm. of social parodies, movie parodies, TV mm-hmm. parodies. Like it's like so good with that in that regard. So I'll, I'll I'm not going to mention Charlie Brown or Garfield because you said them both. Um, my honorable mentions are I have two. It's a tie. I put Thirty Rock. And because there's a couple good Halloween episodes there, and the new girl, because there's also a couple of good Halloween episodes in the new girl. Um, but like I don't remember if it's in the Halloween episode or not, but I just gotta give a big shout out to Werewolf Bar Mitzvah because it's one of the greatest songs of all time. Werewolf Bar Mitzvah, well, good old Tracy Morgan. You took yeah, you took you took the, the, the 30 rock, but the other ones you didn't mention that I, I wanted to bring up was um um and I don't know why, but I saw it online. I was like, oh, I forgot about that one, and that's and one particular episode is the Always Sunny in Philadelphia, Who Got D Pregnant? Okay, even though that really like doesn't have too much Hollywood vibes outside of costumes, it just it's such a great episode. So, I, I I I was close because there are a couple of Halloween episodes mm-hmm. um for Always Sunny. My problem with Always Sunny is there for the amount of seasons they have, there's only like X amount of Halloween. Well, that's like most of the shows we out. mentioned have like a majority yeah. of the seasons have a Halloween episode. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's why I said I'll mention why I plucked it out. It's kind of like this the '70s show, the old Trick or Treat. That's the other one the when they're doing the Hitchcock 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 episodes. Yeah, I I really liked it because of Eric Foreman's part. You know what I mean about well, him. When Wilder Valderrama is Batman '66 is like the best part. <laughs> yes, <it's> the best. <laughs> Uh, but yeah, anyway, I only good. have uh, I have a couple. One of them is the Elvira Halloween special. Yeah, that that, that's that's oh, yeah. I'm such an idiot. We're not thinking yeah. of that. Oh my and, god! And it's not really a Halloween special because he does this every week. But I want to give a shout out to Sven Gulli. Sven Gulli. <laughs> yes, that's a shout out. Mm-hmm. Yep. WWE Halloween special shout out. Yes. Halloween Havoc, is that special? Yes, it is. It's coming WCW. up in two weeks. Look for the review on Johnny Donuts Triple Seven. Wow, free plugs, buddy. <laughs> oh. I thought you were going to say something. Oh, no, no. No. <laughs> no, no. That was like a laugh leading into something from Putty. Usually when you oh, get that no, laugh, no. means something's coming. Um, it's, well, the the it's the mask. I don't have <laughs> anything else. Wait, what mask? I just have a 33 and a third percent chance. Wow. <laughs> Yeah, but no, I, I really, I forgot, I totally forgot about the pink eye episode, buddy. That was a great, great call on that hey, one. The more recent one with the witches, when all the men are oh, witches, yeah. is yeah. so good. We're good. We're witches, bro. Did we're you get witches, the coke? <laughs> They're like all doing drugs and shit in the woods. That's a good one. Um, okay, so I don't have anything else. Are you guys good? Nope, I'm good. All right, if anybody out there in the YouTube knows uh, an episode, let us know in the comments. A special in the comments, an encompassing show in the comments, and peace out, and check out their stuff, and peace out, and remember, peace out.